Global economic organizations are calling for entry restrictions to be eased as the COVID-19 pandemic erodes trade and overseas business activities. Now, this includes the Federation of Korean Industries, which is calling for business people to be allowed in to prevent the global economy grinding to a complete halt. Our Lee Seung Jae with the details. The streets of Hollywood, normally crowded with tourists, looks like a ghost town. India's capital, New Delhi, always a hive of human activity, is virtually deserted as well. With 70 countries declaring lockdowns to prevent their citizens going out and potentially spreading COVID-19, the picture is similar in many places across the world. The Indian government has imposed a strict three-week lockdown, forcing South Korean plants in the country, such as Samsung Electronics and Hyundai Motor, to close down temporarily. With enormous companies forced to seize operations, the world's economy is straining to cope, and corporations are now taking a more aggressive tone in requesting eased entry restrictions. Sixteen international economic organizations, including the Federation of Korean Industries, have issued a joint statement asking for more flexibility for business-related travelers. According to the KFI, foreign workers who need to return to their home countries to renew their visas need to be in self-isolation or obtain a new health certificate before returning to South Korea, a process which can take up to two months. During the peak of the COVID-19 outbreak in South Korea, the KFI previously called on countries to ease travel restrictions for South Korean entrepreneurs, arguing that entry for business purposes should be treated differently to entry for general travel and tourism purposes. Now, the global business community is calling for similar measures as they hope to pick up the pieces, start rebuilding their businesses, and get people back to work. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.